Was it working? It is working. Oh god, the quality is a bit bad. I am sorry. It's it's like 20 to 8 in the morning on a Saturday and yesterday morning at midnight Emma Blackery, Emma Blackery released a new song called Dirt. It took me a good two listens to get used to it, but I'm not going to lie. I can't stop playing it now. It's like obviously her, the direction she wants to go on is completely different to what she's been doing the past few years, which is pop punk, pop rock and like stuff like that. And you know what it is? It's really good. Like the lyrics are bloody brilliant. Um, yeah, so I might cover it. I don't know if I can, if I can like, I need, I need to give it a few more lessons, I think. Before I maybe give it another couple of days, couple, maybe a few more days, and then and then see how, then see how I feel. Cause I don't have a clue what is gonna happen, like with the new album. I don't know what she's calling the new album, but I'm I'm looking forward to it, and I'm impatiently waiting for it to to announce the new tour. And I'm dragging my friend Kirsty with us this time. Um, if not, then Gary. Um, but yeah, like I, I don't know where I'm going with the channel at the minute. Um, with Jessica UK, what well, Field and Films, not Jessica UK ninety one. Bloody hell, that was the old fucking name, Jess. Come on, get get it together, god damn it. Anyway, yeah, um, yeah, it's just like I'm just. In a funk at the minute. Um, normally, when I'm in a funk, what does that mean? Vida. Vida is not going to happen this year, believe it or not. I normally do Vida, but Vida is not going to happen, I don't think, because it's just. I've got too much going on, honestly. I've got far too much going on. <coughs> like in my head and in my life at the minute like mental health is really bad and and I've got an opera coming up which I will be vlogging I am vlogging that I've got an opera coming up for two nights um <coughs> you know I've got a new lab now you know like just trying to just trying to like fit everything in and that's why I'm doing weekly vlogs at the minute just because it's easier at the minute I mean yeah they're not getting as many views I want to pre-record some songs like probably Monday night, Tuesday night, whenever, whenever I can basically, just so I can, just so I can like, you know, like have a few songs to fall back on and stuff like that. But yeah, it's just like I'm really enjoying doing my weekly vlogs at the minute. Like I don't like doing them like too long. Like if I do them like like Louise Pentland does does his, um. Like she just has like forty five minutes long, and I, I do watch them. I do sit there and watch them, like you know, like, like a mini movie. And I haven't watched been watching Emma Blackberry's vlogs, which I should be because I'm I'm supposed to be a true fan. But you know, God damn it, that song is just amazing. Oh my God, that song is just it's. Ah, uh, you know I got dirt on you. You got to do, do, got to wait for two. And bitch, I'm gonna say big no. Oh, shut up, man. Yes, yeah. But yeah, um, I didn't really vlog yesterday because my mental health was pretty bad yesterday. Like there was a lot of stuff going on in my brain and stuff that I didn't really want to talk about. And where is it? And I ended up spending a bomb in the works, and I ended up buying one of these, um, which is a tangle. And I was fiddling with it constantly yesterday. Like honestly, like my brain is going through a bit of a weird funk at the minute. And like when it comes to anxiety, like I didn't expect think, expect like this to turn into an anxiety talk, but but you know. This is what happens when I want to ramble, and and people like it. So, but yeah, this cost a quid yesterday, and all I do is that, 
and it's for some reason it's weirdly therapeutic honestly it's because I'm doing something with my hands I think and that's what happens with me when I'm like really 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 like stressed and angry like I just want to fiddle with with something and and you know what I mean so like I bought that I bought a lot of pens so I've bought I bought a new notepad and I've already written in it so I bought some other tape a minute so yeah so I bought that I've already got that um, this is practically like what's in my bag I did buy a fidget spinner as well so there's a fidget spinner a random fidget spinner as you do you know something else to cope the anxiety sort of thing you know and I've got like about 20 pens in there and I've also got a random llama in there you know this bag's just fucking full of shit and my keys should be in there nope there's a random what the fuck oh I don't know maybe I could do a vida and then just like and then just like pre-film like loads of weird shit I don't know I really don't know so yeah, I'm fiddling with it again I have a feeling this is going to become an essential part of I broke it twice yesterday and like Ali had to like Ali had to like fix it and like like you literally know whatever like like yesterday it was just it was ridiculous like how bad my brain was just like bubbling up like honestly like well like the rehearsals for the opera is just it's just getting so intense at the minute and well it's not getting intense it's just it's just mentally draining and and like this Easter my brain is just gonna be so like full of of the songs we've got 12 songs to learn um my favorite my favorite songs in the opera or maybe just maybe maybe just maybe just maybe we're in love um because we wrote that song um i think the other one three kids no husband and she's two weeks late on last month's rent She's waiting on the child support, but she knows that it's coming. And then a nee 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 Right, Jess, shut up, man. Honestly, it's ridiculous. Like this is how my brain is, making eight point nine percent time, and now I'm vlogging. It's just like, yeah, what the hell is going on with this tangle? Yeah. Oh my god, this tangle is like ridiculous. I mean, like, I don't know, like, what direction to go on with this vlog, with these, with the, with the Field and Films channel, because it's just, like, I'm rambling, I like doing these rambling vlogs, but the photography, even the photography has had to take a step back at the minute, because, because, honestly, my brain is just filled with just weird, weird shit at the minute, and it's just, it's ridiculous, like, the anxiety is t 20 times more, the bloody the bloody creativity is bloody 20 times more. I'm going through the best time of my life and the worst time of my life at the same time. So it's like like two sides of the brain are like like competing with each other. And that's why I wrote two bloody poems yesterday. Two bloody poems in that thing yesterday. And I've also got this, which which um which Lindsay got is for Christmas. And it's still getting used to this day. It's now the 17th of March, and I, I use it practically, like, not every day, but, like, when I really want to. Like, like I'm, I'm determined to use it all up. God damn it. Like, I am going to use it, like, like even if, like, even when it's, like, say it's all bad and tattered, tattered, but you know what it is? I don't care. And I've also bought, um, um like, some a, a wreck this journal everywhere for yourself. And, uh, um, yeah, I'm just, honestly, like, I'm just a mess at the minute, but a good mess, a chaotic mess, and a boyfriend that is a chaotic mess as well, you know, two dyspraxics, and a, in a, um, two dyspraxics walk into a, walk into a, um, kitchen, and then, and then decide to, and then decide to, um, cook, cook a, cook a, um, stir fry in the microwave, you know, because we couldn't think of anything else in my life. Honestly, honestly, me and Gary were such a bloody pair. It's ridiculous. <laughs> From one extreme to the next, eh? 
Yep, and now I have been rambling for nine and a half minutes about shit. But you know, that's that's why I think why I think everyone watches these vlogs at the minute. But yeah, I'm just currently fiddling with a with a with a what you call it, a fidget spinner. Autism is is fun and autism is not fun at the same time. November, November, December. Five months ago to the day I got diagnosed. I'm still discovering everything about myself on a daily bloody basis. Seriously. But I'm trying to get better with the corporate mechanisms. And I'm trying to... <coughs> trying to, like, you know, do stuff. I don't even know where this vlog's going. But, like, maybe I should do, like, a vlog about, like... About, like, um... What helps us when I'm going through a meltdown? Or what helps us going through, like... When I'm going through, like, one of my phases where I'm, like... When my brain's just going, like, a thousand miles an hour. Because, honestly, that happens on a daily basis when my brain is going, like, a thousand miles an hour and it's mostly anxiety. It then It's just... Oh, I don't know. But, yeah, I might do Vida. I don't know. If I pre-record the, the vlogs and come up with some ideas for the vlogs, I think... I mean, I might do a lot of poetry because... Because um, I've written some really good good stuff. Really good stuff that I want to share with people. Like, especially the Hello Anxiety one. And I want to do, like, an animation for, like, Tell Me The Truth About Love. Because the lyrics in it are actually crazy. And, yeah, so... I don't want to be doing too much because I know for a fact that that I had a fit the other week and if I do too much I'll have another fit and oh my god it's just one thing after the next but you know there's not a lot I can do but yeah I'm gonna end this vlog now <laughs>